Sarah from Average Betty here and I'm making angel and devil pasta. I'm using Better For You Dreamfield's angel hair pasta and everyone's favorite devilishly delicious culinary trifecta, bacon gruyere and caramelized onions, or what I like to call gastro gold. Let's make angel and devil pasta. I'm going to start with the bacon. Because I'm making bacon bits, I'm going to chop up the bacon before frying. Cook this low and slow. When the bacon bits are crisp, Remove them from the pan and drain on a paper towel. Next, the caramelized onions. You want to cut them in half lengthwise, then cut into thin slices. Just a nice thin slice here. Let's keep this next step between the two of us, okay? I'm using the same pan that I made the bacon bits, and I'm going to return just a bit of the bacon drippings to the pan. Add a little butter and get this melted together. Devilishly delicious. Here are two onions sliced. I know it looks like a lot, but they're going to cook down. Season with salt and pepper. Give this a good stir and put a lid on it. Who are you telling to put a lid on it? Cook covered over medium low heat about 10 to 12 minutes or until onions are tender and continue cooking and stirring the onions. Add a little water to get some of those caramelized bits off the bottom of the pan. Continue cooking and stirring until they're golden and caramelized. About like this. Get these beauties off the heat and it's time to make the pasta. I've got my water boiling and here's my Dreamfields angel hair pasta. This Dreamfields pasta is high in fiber and low in digestible carbs, so it doesn't overload you like regular pasta. Angel hair pasta cooks quickly, so you want to keep it moving and don't let it overcook. When it's al dente, I use my kitchen spider to fish out the pasta and get it right into the caramelized onion. That little bit of pasta water is going to help create a nice sauce. Get those onions incorporated, toss the pasta with a little more butter, and add the crumbled bacon. Bacon! Add shredded Gruyere cheese and toss again. Cheesy! Let's plate it up. There you go. Bacon! Cheesy! And I like to toss in a little bit of fresh chopped parsley just before serving. And there you have it. Angel hair pasta with caramelized onions, bacon, and Gruyere cheese. Get the angel and devil pasta recipe at averagebetty.com. Look out for Dreamfields pasta in the black box and check out dreamfieldsfoods.com for other great recipes. I hope you try my angel and devil pasta soon because a culinary trifecta of flavor like this one is pure heaven. Find me on Facebook and Twitter and drop by my home at averagebetty.com. Thanks for watching and subscribing. See you next time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.